Today in this story, you will come to know the five bad habits which can ruin your success. So watch the video till end. Let's start the video. In a tranquil village nestled within the mountains, lived a young aspirant named Kai. Eager to find success, he decided to seek the guidance of the village's wise Zen master. The master agreed to mentor Kai and invited him to the mountain temple. As Kai embarked on his journey, he carried a heavy bag of seeds. Each seed represented a potential for growth and accomplishment. Along the way, the Zen master shared his teachings with Kai, revealing the path to success. One day, while they were sitting by a river, the master observed Kai's bag of seeds. He noticed that some seeds had started to sprout, while others remained untouched. Curious, the master asked Kai about the seeds. Kai shared, Master, these seeds are like my dreams and goals. Some have sprouted because I took action promptly, but others I thought I would plant later. The master smiled knowingly and said, Ah, procrastination, my young friend. Remember the story of the tree? The best time to plant it was years ago. The second best time is now. As they continued their journey, the master noticed Kai's tendency to criticize himself. Kai often doubted his abilities and spoke harshly about his progress. The master gently cautioned him, Negative self-talk can be a fog that obscures your potential. Like the two monks at the river, one believed he couldn't cross, and so he didn't. Change your words, change your world. Days turned into weeks, and they came across a lush orchard. The trees bore ripe fruit, a testament to discipline and care. Kai marveled at the sight and turned to the master. These trees are so fruitful, how did they achieve this? The master replied, Discipline, my dear Kai, like the monks who practice before and after enlightenment, consistency nurtures growth. One evening, sitting by the campfire, Kai shared his concerns about pursuing his dreams. What if I fail, Master? What if all my efforts lead to nothing? The Master's eyes twinkled with wisdom. Fear of failure can paralyze even the most determined. Remember, falling isn't defeat. It's an opportunity to rise stronger. Like the saying goes, fall seven times, stand up eight. As they neared the mountain temple, the Master noticed Kai's reluctance to share his progress with others. Kai, feedback is a lantern that guides your journey. Like the student who sought the teacher's guidance on writing, welcome feedback with an open heart. It's how you refine your path. Upon reaching the temple, Kai realized that the journey itself had been a profound lesson. He had learned that the seeds of success required timely action, positive self-affirmation, consistent discipline, courage in the face of failure, and the wisdom to seek and embrace feedback. With the master's guidance, Kai embarked on a new phase of his life, a journey that reflected the wisdom of the Zen stories and the habits that led to his success. If you like this story, then don't forget to like, share and subscribe our channel Bright Stories.